Wow, here's an amazing report. They somehow failed to say if the pretty bridge actually lasts longer than the ugly bridge. One Hennepin County Commissioner is questioning why the county is spending million more, millions more than it needs to on a new bridge over the Mississippi River. He says a more expensive design was chosen only because it's more visually appealing. Tom Hauser is tracking your money tonight. The dilapidated Lowry Avenue Bridge was blown up in June to make way for a sparkling new bridge, a bridge most agree will be a scenic addition to the Mississippi River. It'll be a beautiful bridge, but I think we as a board need to say, you know what, we cannot afford an extra $14 million right now. Hennepin County Commissioner Jeff Johnson says the board voted to spend $80 million on this more aesthetically pleasing bridge, rather than $66 million on a more standard concrete bridge similar to this one. Us Northsiders here have been all my life too. I think we could deal with just a regular bridge. We don't have to have a 35W type one to go across the river. Tom Hoover owns a wheel alignment business on one end of the bridge. He and others we talked to shared similar opinions. A nice bridge would be nice. Uh, economical bridge would make more sense. Could government be more efficient? Sure we could always be more efficient. We should always strive to be more efficient. You know, I'll stand behind this bridge. The bridge will stand in Commissioner Mark Stengline's district. He voted in favor of a new bridge he says will not only be nicer looking, but last up to 200 years. The folks in north and northeast Minneapolis are going to have a gym here, but it's going to be here for my grandchildren to use and your grandchildren. So no second thoughts about voting in favor? No, not at all. Commissioner Johnson remains unconvinced. We're laying off employees. Now is not the time to be spending $14 million more on a bridge than what we need to spend. Tracking your money in Minneapolis, Tom Hauser, 5 Eyewitness News.